Hey, welcome back to Bennett Gaming. I'm Steven, and first things first, I want to tell all of my current subscribers, thank you. It's a huge thank you, and thank you again for your continued support. Wow, I think that was like three thank yous just then. Um, and if you're new to the channel, welcome. Feel free to subscribe for more. Uh, I usually like to put out a lot of Zelda content, but... Anywho, that's a nice little segue. Speaking of Ze Zelda content, um, I just wanted to create a little bit different video, uh, more of just kind of like a talking, talking, chatty kind of video. Um, but um, I don't know if you call it a theory or what. But uh, I don't claim to be a, a theorist or anything like that. But other than just like to put my thoughts out about the game and just because I'm just a fan like the rest of you. I uh, just really enjoy the, the Zelda series. But anywho, after, you know, just the thought occurred to me the other day uh, uh, after, you know, after seeing the, uh, the, the most recent sequel trailer um, of Link falling, basically skydiving uh, to the some of the sky lot. Sky, I don't know. I'll call it Skyloft Islands. Uh, in the in the sequel trailer, uh, it was his uh, something that was very noticeable was his uh, tunic, the apparel and garments uh, that Link were wearing during this trailer during the skydive. Uh, to me, they were very reminiscent of like you know ancient Rome, ancient Greece. I don't know. You know, I'm not really a uh, expert on the clothing of the ancient cultures but anyways that's what it reminded me of it reminded me of like garments of a of a, of a gladiator uh, you know like like that that kind of wardrobe you know and then going uh, let's see I think it was in the yeah in the same trailer we saw you know the corpse of Ganondorf uh, rising, you know, being resurrected by malice, and uh, and uh, I don't know. There's probably some some of you that have already noticed, but the the corpse of Ganondorf uh, appears to be wearing a similar style garments as Link, you know, with the uh, piece of cloth draped over the shoulder, uh, you know, that 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 tunic tunic style kind of wardrobe but it got me thinking you know again you know because the Link's apparel reminded me of like a gladiator type type outfit and then seeing uh, the corpse of Ganondorf also wearing a similar type of outfit and then the next conclusion to jump to is hey we've got a Colosseum on the map in Breath of the Wild and I was just thinking that it would be uh, epic to maybe not for a final battle but for Link and Ganondorf to have some kind of meet up within the Colosseum uh, in, Breath of the, in the Breath of the Wild sequel it, it just seems like it would be a perfect setup uh, you know cause, because some of the one of the things that I love about some of the final battles in uh, uh, the Zelda series is this one on one sword battle where it's, where it's like you know, basically just like the like a cage fight. You know, like the modern day UFC, where it's like, you know, two people enter, one person is going to leave. And uh, I just thought it would be really cool to see uh, a setup, or at least like a, uh, uh, an early, maybe an early battle or, or meet up between Link and Ganondorf in the Colosseum. Uh, in a in a uh, in a completed like uh, what's the word that I'm looking for? Uh, not destroyed, not you know like uh, not a wrecked Colosseum, but like a new construction. You know, maybe maybe have some of like the time travel back uh, to the to the <laughs> this sounds so goofy to the early days of Hyrule when the uh, Colosseum was not destroyed. You know. Uh, before the calamity or whatever, but uh, yeah, I just wanted to put that out there. I thought that would be a cool, uh, cool thing to include in the Breath of the Wild sequel. Some kind of a 
gladiator battle between Link and Ganondorf. Again, you know, just the similarities between their garments uh, that just kind of remind me of like ancient Rome. Thought that that would be a cool little thing to have during the gameplay. Let me know what you think in the comments. Would you guys also like to see a gladiator style battle between Link and Ganondorf in the sequel of Breath of the Wild? Battling it out in the Colosseum. Two, two combatants enter, one leaves, one man standing uh, while the crowd goes wild. While the, the Highlands or whoever is cheering, cheering on the combatants. Uh, but yeah, just wanted to put that out there. Produce a little different style video than what I'm currently doing. And just, uh, again, using this video as a testing grounds to uh, see what kind of content you guys like. Uh, if you've made it this far in the video, thank you. Uh, consider subscribing. And uh, let me know, again, in the comments below what kind of style of videos you guys like. I've been doing a lot of playthrough videos lately. It's been fun uh, editing those. Uh, but uh, just looking for ways to continue to grow the channel and, uh, and uh, produce content that you guys enjoy. Uh, so anyways, thanks again for listening to this, this point in the video. Just want to, again, I can't extend my gratitude enough, uh, enough thanks to all of my current subscribers and supporters. Uh, it's really appreciated. And I think I will quit rambling and I will see you guys in the next video. Enjoy your week and have a wonderful day.